All right, so welcome back. Today in this video, we're gonna be looking at materials and we are continuing um, our practice problems uh, in the materials section of the civil FE exam review. We're gonna be looking at test methods and specifications of metals, concrete, aggregates, asphalt, and wood. Um, so got a few practice problems for you. So let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, so what is one way tip what is one typical way to increase concrete workability? All right, so we are given that it's concrete and we're trying to increase workability. That just means you want to be able to move the concrete um, and be able to, you know, work with it before it pretty much clumps together and is no longer able, uh, you know, it kind of sets and it's, you know, you can't keep working with it, moving it around. Okay, so concrete workability, I don't know, slump testing, air entrainment, adding super plasticizers. I don't know any of this, so I'm gonna search concrete. Maybe I could just do workability. See if something comes up. Workability, two things come up. Workability, workability. All right, water content affects workability. I don't see an answer for that but that affects it. However, an increase in water without a corresponding increase in cement reduces the concrete strength. Super plasticizers are the most typical way to increase workability. Okay. So adding a super plasticizer is the way to increase workability. So see came straight from the handbook, pretty straightforward. All right, number two, which test measures the size of a dent on a material from a known load? All right, so we wanna find a test that measures the size of a dent. They're gonna, like, I don't know these different tests, your it would be beneficial if you memorize these or knew these but i'm just gonna look up the hardness is there a hardness test no hardness let's go through 10 options and you want to measure uh, the size of a dent on a material from a known load. Hardness, hardness. Measured by, okay, hardness. Hardenability, resistance to penetration. Measured by denting a material under known load and measuring the size of the dent. All right. Hardness test it is. We could also look up what impact test is. All right, impact test does come up. Okay, the impact test is used to find energy required to fracture and identify ductile, ductile to brittle transition. Okay. So it's dealing with energy brittleness and temperature all right brittleness brittle brittle materials really didn't find anything there so 
or none of the above. So that gives you a little bit more in depth about some of these different test, test methods. So you can just search them. Typically you'll find what you're looking for. Hey everybody. I know I didn't take time to formally introduce myself at the beginning. So I did want to let you know who I am and how I can best serve you as you're studying for your civil FE exam. So my name is James Huntley and I am a civil engineer who has helped hundreds of individuals pass and dominate their civil FE exam. Now I know this test is tough and as you're going through material, you may be saying, Ugh, I don't remember learning this stuff or gosh, these variables are so confusing or you just feel like you're really, really busy and there's so much material that you need to go through that it's a bit overwhelming. So I did want to let you know that I do help and work with individuals one on one to ensure that they pass their civil FE exam. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for 10 weeks and that's the longest that it has been. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for two weeks and we went back to back day after day after day, hours on hours on hours, putting in the work, um, working together to ensure that they went ahead and passed. Right. And this exam is so important because I know that you want to make more money. Um, I know that you want to, you know, get some promotions and be able to further your career and have your PE. So definitely want to open and extend a hand out. Want to be able to save you time, right? Because I know some people that watch my videos, you may have been watching my videos for six, nine, even 12 months and you still haven't passed your civil FE exam. And that is the one thing that's keeping you from making more income more impact and furthering your career. So it's definitely costing you um, money, resources, everything. So looking to create more success stories. Um, I am looking to work with individuals one on one. I want to hop on Zoom with you. I want you to share what you're doing as you're solving these problems so I can spot out what you may be struggling with and open your eyes so that you're not going into this test completely blind. Now, for some of you, you may have failed a test once, twice, had some people fail five times, um, or you may be wanting to take this test initially and you just want to make sure that you pass it up front. So do have one-on-one -on -one services. I also have some uh, do-it-yourself uh, courses that if you're like, no, I got this, I got it all on my own, I know everything, or I, I'm going to take the time to study everything, I do have some resources and materials to be able to help you in that way. But my biggest fear is that you're investing in something, uh, these programs or these courses, and you know, you're not... Uh, getting back or having proper feedback to help you and to push you forward. You're just giving a bunch of information and no one's sharing with you what you may be actually struggling with or what's keeping you from passing your FE exam. So looking to create a ton of success stories. So feel free um, down in the description box below. I have a ton of resources, including one-on-one -on -one coaching. Let's hop on a call. Uh, it's no cost to you as far as, you know, us talking through your goals and what you're trying to do um, and kind of getting a feel for where you're at. Um, so have some programs where I can work with you one on one. And there's also some do it yourself courses, practice exams, study guides, resources, free material, all of that down in the description box below. So feel free to check out that stuff. If you like the video, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. This is what I do. Um, we want to get you to the next phase of your civil engineering career um, and leave a comment. If you had any questions about um, what I went through, the information that I covered um, and feel free to um, definitely schedule a call with me and 
and looking forward to creating more success stories. So be sure to check out this next video.